Your Vivo Smart 4 comes loaded with fitness and wellness monitoring features to help you track your daily activity with style. In this video, we'll walk you through the process of setting up your new activity tracker out of the box so you can start using it. For starters, you'll need to plug in the Vivo Smart 4 to set it up. Just align the pins on the included charging cable to the ports on the back of the device and firmly clip the charger on. Then plug it in to charge. You'll know it's connected if you see the display turn on. Now, if you've never installed the Garmin Connect mobile app before, go to the App Store on your smartphone and download it. Once the app finishes installing, open it up and set up an account. You'll enter your email address, some basic information about you, and you can even select a profile image. Once that's done, the app will automatically scan for devices in your area that are ready to pair and will begin the process. If your Bluetooth is off, the app will ask you to turn it on. Don't worry, Vivo Smart 4 uses Bluetooth Low Energy or BLE, so it won't drain your phone's battery. To make best use of the device, keep Bluetooth on full time. If you already have Garmin Connect Mobile because you've used another Garmin device, you won't need to install it again. But we recommend you make sure it is up to date by going to the App Store to see if there are any updates available. Older versions of the app may not be compatible with the device, so be sure to keep it updated. Once you're sure it's up to date, open it up. You may need to sign in if it's been a while. Once you're signed in, iPhone users should click the More button in the lower right corner of the My Day page to open up the main menu. Android users should click the Slide Out Menu button in the upper left to open the main menu. From there, scroll down and tap Garmin Devices, and then tap Add Device. The app will begin searching for devices in the area and should find your Vivo Smart 4. To complete the pairing, enter the six-digit code that is displayed on the device. After pairing is complete, the app will walk you through a series of customization options, such as selecting sleep times, wake times, and watch faces. And will even walk you through some guided tutorials, such as how to start a timed activity. You can always go back to Garmin devices later if you decide you want to change any of your custom settings. Remember to check the app frequently. This ensures that your data is being stored in a timely manner and that your device stays up to date with the latest software. Each time you open the app, it will try to perform a sync with your device. When the device is syncing with the app, you will see this symbol in the upper right corner of the app. Stay within 10 feet of your phone while this process completes. You'll also need to sync after any settings are changed in the app so you can apply them to your device. That's it for now. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out the other videos in this series to learn more about Vivo Smart 4 and what it can do to help you stay fit and active in style.